These statements are among the many revelations made by the US CDC's alarming report on the Delta variant of COVID-19. Referring to the lethality of this variant, the US CDC report acknowledged that the war has changed with the highly contagious mutant causing more severe illness than all other known versions of coronavirus. Quoting the CDC's internal document, media reports highlighted that the Delta variant could spread as easily as chickenpox. When we look at the R0, the transmission of SARS-CoV-2, the original variant, from person to person, it was from one person to maybe two or three people. But the new Delta variant now transmits to, on an average, five people. And the chances of transmitting as a super spreader are much higher. The chances of cluster spreading within families or workplaces is much higher. And the viral load required to transmit the virus is much lower, which means more people can get infected faster. On Tuesday, Dr. Rochelle P. Walensky, the director of the CDC, said that vaccinated people may carry just as much virus in the nose and throat as unvaccinated people and they may spread it just as quickly. Not just unvaccinated people, but it has even been found that vaccinated people, if they catch the infection and maybe just have a mild infection, can still spread this Delta variant virus very efficiently because of the nature of the illness and as I said, much lower viral loads required for transmission. Most certainly unvaccinated people because they have higher viral loads would be more efficient transmitters of the disease. But really all this brings up to the point that wearing masks and maybe even double masks is so important going forwards in, in handling and managing this pandemic. According to the CDC data, the Delta variant is causing roughly 35,000 symptomatic infections per week among 162 million vaccinated Americans. Laying out a broader and even grimmer view of the Delta variant, CDC said it is more transmissible than the viruses that cause MERS, SARS, Ebola, the common cold, the seasonal flu and smallpox. The tone of the document reflected the caution of scientists and researchers and the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Clearly, the constantly evolving variant of coronavirus is making the battle harder for healthcare authorities across the world. The CDC is much concerned with the incoming data calling the Delta variant a serious threat that requires immediate action. The document noted that the Delta variant produces virus amounts in the airways that are 10 times higher than those infected by the Alpha variant. While in another shocking revelation, the US CDC reports that those infected by the Delta variant carry thousandfold more viruses than people affected by the Alpha variant. According to the Federal Health Authority, the CDC report is a compilation of data from multiple studies on the deadly variant. Although the document makes grim and scary revelations, it also highlights the fact that vaccination can prevent more than 90% of the severe disease. However, it added that the current vaccines could be less effective in preventing the infection and transmission of the virus.